Hi guys, it's Inam Kafour here with the flagship Samsung Galaxy S3 in white along the left hand side which is the international quad core version and the newly born Samsung Galaxy S3 mini. Now we're going to take a look at some benchmarking tests between both these devices, see how they compare. Now I know both these devices aren't really comparable because the S3 mini is just a dumbed down version of the Galaxy S3 flagship model but I'm just interested to see what the scores are going to be. So first off we're just going to go into our applications here and load up Quadrant Standard on both the devices and then we'll see what benchmarks they can both pump out. We'll do a full benchmark on both, so here we go, three, two, one, go. Both of them have finished now, but noticeably the S3 flagship model finished way ahead of the S3 Mini. So we'll just say proceed to both. Just zooming in there so you can see the your device score on the flagship model to be 5,299 compared to the S3 Mini's your device score of 3,002. Right, we'll come out of that on both. And what we'll now load up is Antutu Benchmark on both. Again, we'll do a full benchmark on both of the devices, see how they compare. We'll go to test on both the devices and do a full start. Both the devices have finished running their tests on Antutu. Just zooming in there so you can see the total score on the flagship Samsung Galaxy S3 to be 15,826 compared to the younger Mini Brother being 6,799. We'll come out of Antutu now on both. And what we'll do is we'll run Geekbench 2 on both of these as well. It gives you a rundown of specs on both the devices. So on the flagship model, it gives you Samsung Galaxy S3, operating system being Android Jelly Bean 4.11, with a, a quad-core Exynos CPU running at 1.4 gigahertz, with a total memory of one gig, but the available memory on here is showing 833 megabytes, because the rest is reserved for system. On the mini younger brother, You've got the model number there, also the operating system being Android Jelly Bean 4.11. You've got the dual core ARM V7 1GHz processor and 1GB of RAM, although it's shown 804. As I say, the remaining is used for system. We'll go ahead and run full benchmarks on both. On this particular score, the S3 flagship model ranks in at 1,763 compared to the S3 Mini's 711. As we expected, the S3 kills it in all the tests, but it's interesting to see how much of a difference there is between the two. But both the devices are great phones. The S3 Mini, having a smaller form factor, means having less hardware to play with as well. This has been a benchmark comparison between the Samsung Galaxy S3 and the younger S3 Mini brother. Just to give you an idea of how much they differ giving the S3 Mini has a smaller form factor with less hardware to play with as well. Any questions or comments you guys have got, hit them up down in the comment section down below there. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video and you like what you saw. If you haven't already done so, hit subscribe from the button down there. It doesn't cost you anything and it's totally free. And you can check out some of our forthcoming videos. Thanks for watching, have a wicked day and we'll see you next time.